Hello everyone. Welcome to Rupicom. In the previous video, we have successfully received the mail from Rupicom with some admin portal login details and mobile login details. Today, we will discuss about how to login into admin portal. But before that, copy these credentials and we have the direct option here to get login. Click on this login button. On the login page, paste the credentials like email ID and password which you have copied from your mail and click on sign in button. Once you have logged in, the first step to running your business on Rupicom is creating a store. Click on create button to get started. Maximize the screen to see the platform's 5 main sections here. Let's go through each section one by one. First comes a geofence. This lets you choose areas where your business is active. Now first geofence a map pointing. Click on full screen option for better view. Here, I will place my store location at Nellore. By using polygon symbol, I draw the serving area for Nellore. I will also include Kavali and Nellore as my serving areas. This explains that my service is limited only to these particular areas like Ongol, Kavali and Nello. Next, with the help of edit symbol, you can adjust the location. And if you made a mistake, simply click on delete symbol to remove it. Once your geofence is perfect, now move to the live option here. Let me explain with a simple example. If you are staying in Bangalore and want to place an order in Nello, you can do this by turning off the live option here. This allows you to place orders without depending on your current location. However, if the live option is enabled, you must be in these specified areas to place the order. Choose any of these depending on your service. Next we have delivery option. By enabling this, your order will only be delivered to these specific areas which you have selected in the map pointing. After is a mock prevent. This helps to prevent fake location apps. Just enable this. Next the store location and the serving area are filled up once you have perfectly geofenced your service area. Now coming to the general section. In this, you have to enter your store's details. Start by entering your store's name here, phone number, PIN code, and any announcement regarding your store. After that, upload image representing your store. And next, by enabling this active option, your store is active in the mobile app for the customers to view. Next, enter the store's address here. Followed by the city name and enter the price ranges that you offer in your store. Make sure by entering each price you have to click on enter and proceed.
now move to the delivery team once you have created a store and access to the admin portal there you can create a delivery team and can assign this here now move to the payment mode rupeecom provides you three types of payment modes like razor pay ticket store and cash on delivery select any of these payment methods by enabling the buttons that you want to provide to your customers for example here i enable razor pay and cash on delivery finally is the delivery or package cost in the delivery option you can charge your desired amount for delivering the products for example here i enter 50 rupees for delivering my products and in the package option you can set the charge for packaging the products for example here i enter 20 rupees next is a free package or delivery for example if you have bought the products cost 2000 rupees in this case the delivery and the packaging cost are free otherwise you have to pay an extra amount of 70 rupees for packaging and delivery enter the amount of your choice here once check all the details that you have filled are correct Now click on yes button. Automatically your store is created successfully. Now your business is in your hand. In the next video we will know the features and the modules that are present in the store. Until then stay focused. Bye bye.